Oh, come back. Yes, you are back. With your boy Scarshus, we are in the Master League right now. We have our Groudon on the lead and we are faced up against a new two. We definitely do not mind this. Let's see how they want to play it out. They tried to catch on Dragonite. How cute. Good attempt, but you don't prevail. Now you're locked in with Zation. So thanks for doing me a favor. Go on, you throw first. What's it going to be? All right, so you go for that superpower. <laughs> Lowering their defense. They're basically just scrapping the dragon that has no play here. By, by a Dragonite, back comes their Mewtwo. We're gonna let their side strike go here. Come back in with our Groudon and offload straight away. So let's see what the vibe is. Let's go. How are you feeling like? You already know this will be doing big damage. Yep, as you can see. I'm gonna shield up this side strike and farm down and see what they got in the back. What's it gonna be? <laughs> it's, just, it's the algo, of course. Who else? All right, going straight for it. No baiting. We don't care if they got two shields. Let's see what the vibe is. Yeah, they knew that's a wrap due to the tree. Yeah. Nicely done. All right, let's take that W and move swiftly into the next one. Okay. See what the vibe is. Okay, Dialga, we love to see it. You're not hiding in the back today. Let's see what they want to do here. Does this trainer want to attempt to catch also? Yeah, straight for it. What do they want to do? Do they want to shield up? We ain't baiting. Yeah, they shield that up. Okay. They might try to, to catch the second one. But be cautious. Let me throw in the charge move here. What's it going to be? Iron head or that Draco? We go for the iron head. Okay, what do they want to do? They tried to swap out. They swapped out slightly early. But we were expecting a catch anyway, so they swapped out into their ho-ho. We come with our Mewtwo. We can offload some side strikes here. Alright. They offload in their charge move here. Is it that sacred fire? Nice, that brave bird. Shielding that up. They've lowered their defense. We're gonna go. For another surge strike here. How they feeling like? Are they letting the ho-ho go? They do. Bye-bye. Expecting that Diablo to come back. Should be at Iron Head or just short of an Iron Head. Yeah, he should be just short of an Iron Head. But they bring their Giratina in instead. Okay, interesting. Gonna have to eat this Ice Beam real quick. You already know the vibes. Some nice damage. And we dip out straight away into our Zation. We're not hanging in there to be farmed down. Cool snot. All right. They offload the Shadow Ball. That's cool. Do you not want to swap into the Dialga? The yep, there they go. Expecting it. I'm going to throw a close combat. And expecting them to use their last shield at some point here. You know, they let it go. Okay, that's cool. You point it all on Giratina, are you? Interesting. <laughs> Very interesting. Go for the close combat because they have to use their shield, right? And they do. <laughs> but yeah, this one's looking like a wrap. Some interesting plays from them, but it doesn't work out. And that's the G to the G. Precipice blades stored and ready to go. Nicely done. All right. 
we will take that W and move swiftly on into the next one. Okay. Let's get it. Faced up against a new two. Okay, okay. You already know the play here. You can eat a side strike. But they can't eat a precipice blades comfortably. Nah. So let's see what the vibe is here. They go for that side strike, we let that go and now we can offload our energy. Let's see how they're feeling like. Yeah, they respect it and they show that up. It's fine. Go for another one and they see and hear it, which is cool. We're going to shield this up though. Matching their shields. Um, what do they want to do here? Do they want to give up their last shield? We know they got a Dialga hiding in the back as per usual. And they're trying to protect it, but we still have a Zayshu in the back who can also deal with it. So what do we want to do here? I think we're going to just let it go here. It's absolutely fine. Alright. Seeing what the vibe is, seeing what angles are coming. But yeah, we go for the Zation. Start getting ahead on that energy. We can eat a side strike here if we want. At some point, we're gonna have to shield. Let the first go. And just trying to get some extra energy. They, they probably knew that. And now they swap into the Kyoga. Okay. Absolutely fine with me. Absolutely fine with me. Okay. They should be getting off a surf at some point. And they decide to lay it off here. We're gonna show this up. Show this up, get some extra energy, get this Kyogre out of the way. And if that Mewtwo wants to come back in, he's gonna have to get our Mewtwo out of the way first and our Zation's ready with energy, so let's see how they decide to play this. What's it gonna be? Yep, there's that Dialga, who's hiding. You back. Switch clock's not quite ready yet. So I'm gonna just offload the charge move here. Have we got time to get out of here? We do throw that close combat, get this Dialga out of here. Now what do this you two wanna do? What do you wanna do? And we're just gonna throw throw that close combat. They gotta throw energy. They gotta throw energy, but they need enough energy to take out our Zacian and our Mewtwo. But that ain't gonna be happening, so GG. Nicely done. All right, taking that W, let's move on into the next one. Who's it gonna be? <laughs> We're about to see. Okay, Zacian, we don't mind this. You already know we don't mind this. Anything on the ground, we don't mind to see. <laughs> Maybe not a Kyogre though. <laughs> they decide to swap out into the Yavalto. <laughs> yeah, locking themselves in against our Zacian, we love to see it. Love it. They go for that focus blast. Okay, okay. Offloading that play rough, which you know does that big damage. So, you know the vibes. And we can just get some extra energy. But we offload. Absolutely fine. This game is still in our hands. We're still in the driver's seat. Alright, back comes their Zation. Gonna offload here. What's it gonna be? Player off, wild charge. Who do you wanna go for? Wild charge. Okay. 
we hang on in and now we can offload the close combat back before we go down with our Zation. Okay, our Zation's job is done. All right, they're throwing again. Are they looking to dip out straight after? We're gonna shield that up. And I'm going for the fire punch. Should be able to get some extra energy if we choose to here. They decide to shield though, so that's even better. And in the back, they got Zamazenta. That's perfect for our Mewtwo, right? Let's go, man. Eat this side stretch. Oh, this one's gonna wrap up that Zamazenta though. Night, night. He exits as fast as he made an entrance. Back comes the Zation, but this is an uphill task for it. Asking too much of this Zation to take out our ground on the Mewtwo. So they decide to top left, and that's a G to the G. Nicely done. All right, moving on into the last one. Let's get it. Mewtwo lead, and we're faced up against a Melmetal. You don't mind this. We don't mind. Going straight back to back resisted side stroke, we still win this matchup, so we definitely don't mind. But we're building up a lot of energy, so they may think we have a focus blast and he might decide to shield. Let's see what they wanna do here. They do decide to shield. They respect focus blast. And you don't see much Mewtwo's running Focus Blast nowadays. You just gotta have the big balls to decide to no shield that. But anyway, we have shield advantage. Offloading them side strikes. Back to back. Let's go. All right. Alright, so Groudon is set up to farm down here, which is going to be a very nice as long as they have no fire in the back. And we're coming with Groudon to farm this down. They may not enjoy being farmed down. They're going to go for that superpower, I expect. At this point, they might as well just finish getting farmed down now. They should have exited a long time ago. See what they want to do. Yeah, they stay to get farmed down. Lovely for us. And now they come in with their landers. I mean, we should have came in with it ASAP, but that's absolutely fine. We wanted to make sure that their flyer was aligned to our ground. Okay, that's fine because we have a nice energy head start. And the fire punches from grounding do add up nicely onto this lander, so. It's not walled, not by Landorus. So offloading them fire punches and you can see, look at the Landorus, very low. And then we try to catch a superpower here, but this trainer is smart enough to go for the Stone Edge, but that's absolutely fine. And now they come in with Sol Galileo, no problem. No problem. Pasol Galeo does not resist close combat because of that part steel type. So, as you can see, the close combat does some nice respectable damage. They go for Psychic Fangs. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Groudon can come back in now and deal with this steel type. So let's go. The are very low. The Solgaleo about to get nicely chipped away at. And the, the fire punch from this range will take it out. So just making sure we've got enough energy to deal with this Solgaleo and the Landorus. What do they want to do here? Do they want to shield it? Yeah, they, they use a the last shield here. It's absolutely fine because now that's going to help us ramp up some more energy and they're gonna realize that and then try and swap out but it's gonna be too late here they swap out this fire punch will be taking out their landers 
And then they'll have to come back with their Sol Galeo here. They won't be getting to a charge move. And this fire punch will wrap things up like a Christmas present. And that was the last battle. So thank you guys for coming by once again. You all take care now. Peace.